Food security and nutrition are the essential requirements for human daily life. According to the Food and Agriculture Organization FAO, the number of people in the world who are currently suffering from hunger may increase by 100 million more in addition to the 690 million people currently suffering from hunger. Therefore, in order to produce good quality products that are nutritious and safe, which is fundamental to food security, all the countries around the world are implementing appropriate policies according to their respective countries' requirements. In Myanmar's efforts to achieve food security, plans are being underway to improve the production of various types of rice, which is a main staple food in Myanmar, so as to meet regional self-sufficiency, to have good quality for consumption, and to fetch a good price in the international market. With the aims to extensive manufacturing of agricultural products and expanding the cultivation of various crops, it is being materialized to shift from conventional farming to mechanized farming system in conjunction with distribution of farm implements and systematic reclamation of farm lands and highland plots. Nama is also implementing measures to develop meat and fish sector to ensure to provide full nutrition and to modernize the livestock industry. Because of this action, even during the outbreak of the COVID-19 pandemic in 2020-2021, rice could have been cultivated and also other major oil crops such as peanuts, sesame, sunflower and different varieties of pulses were also cultivated and produced. Furthermore, millions of tons of meat, milk and eggs could have been produced. Due to the strenuous efforts for the improvement of agricultural and poultry production and ensuring to bring out standard quality products, the country has attained self-sufficiency of rice, beans and pulses and then the surplus are able to be exported to international countries. In addition, Namai is cooperating with ASEAN countries for development of regional food security. ASEAN countries have already committed to cooperate for ensuring of food security, food safety and nutritional security, and all member countries are discussing the measures taken by each country before and after the outbreak of COVID-19, as well as the challenges they are experiencing. ASEAN Integrated Food Security Framework and Strategic Plan of Action on Food Security in the ASEAN Region 2021-2025 has been established so as to achieve the targeted goal, long-term food security and improve the livelihood of farmers in the region. Emphasis is being paid for domestic food security that leads to greater economic stability, better health, the empowerment of the citizens and a reduction in climate problems. <laughs>